right away we've got a diamond we've got diamonds guys we've got diamonds right here in the background can the naked eye tell the difference between a diamond and a cubic zirconia well um if you said that the diamond is set on 14 carat if you said that that one carat diamond is set on 14 carat yellow gold on your right side, then you are correct. And the cubic zirconia is on the left. And almost always when you look at diamond, you're not going to see a lot of color. It's going to be very clear. Whereas in a cubic zirconia, you, there's so much color in a cubic zirconia in this sparkle. But you can actually see the darkness. You can see a lot more darkness in that cubic zirconia as opposed to uh, the diamond there. And we'll go back into the sunlight. You can see maybe if I take the camera out of the sunlight. There we go. Yeah, you can see the darkness in the cubic zirconia. And you see a lot more color in that cubic zirconia as opposed to the diamonds, like a lot clearer. And, of course, we know the best way to uh, determine whether or not a diamond and a cubic zirconia is real is to use the diamond tester. Unfortunately, both of my hands are full right now. So what we're going to do is cut the scene and let's go inside and let's test the difference between a cubic zirconia and a diamond. And we'll see what it looks like sitting at my desk and I'll pull out the diamond tester. All right, let's go inside and let's pull out the diamond tester. Now that we are indoors, it is very hard to tell the difference between the two stones. I'm thinking that has something to do with the fact that I've got a lot going on in this room. I've got a green screen right behind me and we're seeing a lot of color in both stones but you do notice that because i do have the cubic zirconia in my left hand right here set on silver and i've got the diamond set on 14 karat yellow gold you can notice at the two stones that the cubic zirconia actually has a lot more different light like you're seeing like pink yellow green like like a rainbow in there and it's a lot if you look through it You'll know, you notice that it's a lot darker. You can see like there's like black in it as well, where you don't see that in the diamond. But at the same time, that might have something to do with the fact that I'm looking through the lens of the camera at the same time. I'm not actually looking directly at the diamond. So I guess the real only way to tell whether you've got a diamond or a cubic zirconia is to pull out the diamond tester and test the thermal heat going through the stone. So let's do that right now. Okay, so I'm holding the cubic zirconia in my left hand. I'm going to grab the diamond tester right here. And we're going to test whether or not this cubic zirconia is real or not. And as you can see there, it's not beeping. I'm not getting nothing. It's not, it's not moving at all. All right, we'll try to, we'll try to put it down or even put it up a little bit. Still nothing. No beeping, nothing. So that is not a diamond. That is a cubic zirconia. There's no heat going through it. I've got to do some more research on what that, on why that is. But yeah, there's, there's, there's no, there's got no soul. It's got no soul, guys. See, that's not a diamond. That's a cubic zirconia. And then if we pull the diamond out right here, put that down just a little bit. Let me test this diamond. Right away, we've got a diamond. We've got diamonds, guys. We've got diamonds right here. And uh, I think I was, when we were outside in the car, you couldn't really see a lot of color when we were when we were outside in the sun. But for some reason, when I come inside, I'm seeing a lot of color in that stone. I'm thinking it has something to do with the fact that I've got a lot of stuff going on in this room. I got a lot of different colors coming from all over the room, coming from computer screens. I've also got a green screen wall right behind me as well. So maybe that's why we're seeing a lot of color. But when we test it, you can see we've got a diamond. And if we pull back out the cubic zirconia, we got nothing. The cubic zirconia has no soul. The cubic zirconia has no soul, guys. Anyways, that's how you can tell the difference between a diamond and a cubic zirconia. Anyways, and that's a diamond. Anyways, guys, as mentioned on my videos, 
Smash that like button. Subscribe to both channels. If you want to learn how to turn $1,000 into $100,000, I talk about cryptocurrency every single day on my second channel. And uh, we're always looking for opportunities for us to multiply our value. Anyways, smash up the likes buttons. Subscribe to both channels. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.